let's do this, people. Hello, this is the Redstone Innovator here, and we're back with another video. So, um, in today's video, we shall be looking at this lovely system now. This is a fully functioning red a fully functioning uh cash machine i always forget cash machine using redstone so it completely works so yeah so let's uh i'll, I'll sh just take a screenshot oh i don't care so first let's just uh get i've already set up one bank account um yeah so we're going to put the leave a like because that's what we should do leave a like yes leave a like okay <laughs> um so we're going to press that button let's wait a little while because all the redstone mechanics are going on should come soon Kwee. Oh, there we go. We have our chest, and it has our live a like in. Now, we're really rich people. So, of course, we have our diamonds. Now, let's put. Now, you can. You can only put 15 stacks of items in here. I may. How is that? That's. I think. I believe so. Yeah, I believe so. So. 9 and 9 is 18, so let's take away. Let's take. We want to take away three stacks. And then we have our leave alike. You can send back, that back into system. We dive. At least all our money's in the gap regime, so. Yeah. Uh, that should come back now. Now we can uh, say, oh, let's go to our next day. Let's put it the card in. So we've already done that. Um, press the button. Wait a little while. It can take a little while for it to work. Um, because, yeah, I shouldn't see. Uh, okay. We have all our diamonds and a leaf alike. So... Now I'm going to show you how to set up a bank account. We have to one four. So subscribe as well. That's what you need to do. Leave a like and subscribe. So to set up our bank account, we're going to let's just put all those four in. Press the button once. Wait a couple of seconds. Nothing should happen. That's really good. Press the button again. Something should happen this time. Uh, so basically, yep, yeah, here comes our minecart chest. And it should have nothing in, yay! So we're going to send this back, that will just go back into the system. And we press our button again, we'll have our second to last one in, that should come back again. So it can be a bit of a tedious process at the beginning, but once you've once you've made a bank account, it's not too long. As you can see, you should have nothing in again because, of course, they need triplets just to make sure that it is totally legitimate. Let's just get rid of that, and then we'll press the button again, and that should be our last one gone. Yes. Oh my god. So as you can see it should have our subscribe in. So the way this works is let's just send it back. Um I'll explain. So let's put our subscribe in. Okay, we're gonna have to quick quick go. What it does is it goes over here, it goes through that item filter, it triggers that, which then sends this minecart going all the way over here. And it comes back down like that. So that's basically how it works. So um, basically the I 
the piece of paper will go through this item filter, which is actually what it is, it's just a renamed piece of paper. It will go through this item filter, it will. And as you can see, all these repeaters here. And, uh, yeah, as you can see, pretty basic item filter. We actually showcased that item filter on the channel before. So then it comes around. Because it goes on here, this changes, and it will go, it'll go to this one next, then this one, then this one. And it goes all the way back, and it goes to there. So that's how that works. So, as, I, as you can see, it's not that long once uh, you've set it up, but it can take a little while for the minecart to get there, actually, it can. So you just have to be quite careful with that. So let's just, um, should we see which bank account we get? Should we get the, I wonder if we'll get the rich one or the poor one? Go. Because if you didn't know, a, drop, a dropper will um, send out a random one. Oh, I hear it. We're rich! Yay! So clearly, the leave a like came. So let's, let's, that's enough of that messing around. Let's just crack on with this tutorial. So, this tutorial, you will need some blocks, of course. Yeah. Some detector rails, some normal rails, some powered rails, some, some levers, just to pack that. That may be what you want. Uh, redstone torches, some repeaters, some redstone dust, and some uh, comparators. And uh, let's just. I'm gonna get some hoppers and the droppers. It has to be a dropper and a button. So, quite a couple of items, quite a few items, but yeah, it's not. Not too bad. Let's. I'm just gonna come out looks like that. I'm gonna come out a lot because it's not the most compact thing on the channel. Um, this one I don't. We won't beautify it as much. Ah, uh, so. Then anyway, So I want to start off by placing a couple of blocks on there. So we actually. Let's we'll start it. So we have a block here. This is where your minecart is going to be so we're going to place a powered rail around two blocks then you want to place two normal rails yeah and then actually you want to come out another block and place another normal rail you want to place a block here and you want to make an l and uh you just take that out um three blocks from there and you want to place yourself a normal rail a detect rail and then a normal rail then a powered rail and you want to just sort of do this for the rest so you want here you want to place two powered rails and just blocks coming around like that you want to place uh, your powered rail your normal rail your repeater no not your repeater your detect rail you actually want to place some blocks there so it doesn't just go and fly flying off the edge that would not be good that would not be fun and then you want to place another two blocks like that. And this, um, you make this as long or as short as you like. How cool would it be if you like multi layered it? That'd be cool. But then, like, if you had it from there, then like um, it would have to go all, all the way from from here down all the layers, and then back up the layers, and then to there. It would be quite a long time could be waiting an hour so you want to do exactly the same process like that oh, stupid nope that was the wrong button which button is it that uh, okay um so we've done three let's just do two more like that so It'll come out of three box and then we'll go place powered rail, powered rail, normal rail, normal rail, and detector rail, detector rail, 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 then we'll place rails, powered rails like that, and then, and then here you actually want to just uh, power your rails, like 
that just because that's what you need to do for the time. Um, so then you want to just just place your blocks there. Now um, let's get on with this then. Now I'm not going to decorate it as nicely as I decorated that one because that was yeah you know, I, I I could put more I put more time into them. So um you want to come actually we're gonna want our drop button and our button. So so here you want to come four blocks, so actually three blocks, so it's on the fourth it is. So one, two, three, four. So here. No. It actually wants to just be in line with these blocks it does. These blocks it. I put it on the put it on the second block like that. You want to get a button, Ooh. and just do that by clicking, and let's just place a couple of blocks on it. Yeah, and, and you can decorate this a bit more, but this is just, uh, I'm just doing it like this, and it doesn't look very nice, really, if I'm honest. If I'm totally honest with you, it looks horrendous. <laughs> it looks like a horrendous mess. I'm just, so, I've got a bit of a booth here, uh, you could like make it look more realistic, and then I just tend to um, put blocks all the way like this. Just say it's harder to see all the redstone mechanics and stuff. And, uh, but of course you will see some, but I like to have it as hidden as possible. So here we will want our hoppers now. Now if we go, actually no, we want to come all the way to the end. Now uh, that should be two blocks up like that. You know it correctly. Now um, you want to run your hopper line like that, going along. There you go. No. Okay, that's quite simple. And then you want to um, get your hoppers again and uh, run them into the rails like that so that's a so you get a hopper running into that rail and then you want yourself a um and another hopper facing into that hopper like that actually we, we actually want to extend that one more block we do okay you want to place blocks on the side of here i'm just doing that by shift clicking oh really like that. Now you want to place, get your com your competitors. Can't speak today. And place them all the way along like that on all of those blocks. Now, not place blocks on there like that. And uh, then you want to actually. Uh, this is this is really cool. This is uh, might not sound that cool, but what you do is you place a block here. You place a block there. Block there. Mm -hmm. Block there, block there, and that block is so essential. And then you put block there. Yeah. I don't. It's just so quick, you know. It should be like boom, boom, boom. You don't actually do it quicker than that, but like boom, boom, no boom, boom. If you're more accurate at placing blocks than me, you you could do it a lot quicker. Yeah. And the pattern sort of looks quite cool. And you wanna, so you wanna just carry on that pattern. So it's almost like an O, almost, like that, oh, no, I forgot to, you shouldn't be able to see through them, you shouldn't be see through, and then you want, let's just get our redstone dust, and we're going to place that, just coming all the way along like this, And then we're going to place redstone torches underneath all of these. Then that should lock the hoppers now. Let's grab our repeaters. And we're going to place uh, the repeaters on there like that. That's it. Uh, so you just place them all on there. Now, that's really your sorting system done for it. But now what you want to do, so then it activates the rails, so you want to place two blocks like that, and a piece of there, a piece of there. So you want to place two blocks with repeaters on, really. Like that. 
So then um, once this redstone activates, you know, I was just thinking if you could do them close together, I don't think you could. Um, actually probably you could. Actually no, because then that redstone dust because it will be it will power be that block and power that and it will mess it all up. No. <laughs> so uh that won't work. Uh -huh. Hate when when you fall into a void. So you just want to place carry on placing your pieces like that. So then you want to get your hoppers again. And you want to place your hoppers into all of those comparators like that. Now, really, for the rest of the of things, you want that's pretty much you don't. So, right. now you want minecart with a chest. You don't. You want to place them on all of these. Uh huh. So then we also. I'm gonna get this dirt up in here. I've just renamed it to a load of random letters. Uh, you can rename it to Jeffrey. But like, I just name it loads of random letters just because what are the chances of someone getting the exact same one? You know? The, the chances are quite low. So you just wanna, um, like that. You wanna place, uh, um, in there, and you want to just uh, place 18 items into there like that. And that's your first module done, really. So, but we just want to do two all the others. Right, and so we want to go to 18, like that. Now that. Oops. Like that. Don't just want some more. And this can be whatever you want, as I say. Now, um, if you, oh, I'm doing this, I'm as well tell you something. If you didn't know, um, cities. I'm having a gap week next week. Um, so that's a whole week that so I'm not recording. Or really, actually, I might be. I might be recording a couple of videos, but I'm not going to be releasing any videos um so yeah i'm not going to be really seeing any videos now I be um but the week after that we have a new series starting now um that is the city series it is um that shall be starting in just after next week so you can get excited for that, um, that's coming out, and, what else is that? Yeah, and, uh, I've actually built this contraption, and, you know, what am I doing? I pressed a Windows key. I just pressed a Windows key. Damn things, I don't Um, that looks like you are pretty much done. So let's set up. We want an anvil to set up. Let's get ourselves an anvil. Uh, a piece of paper and some missing. Why don't they put it in I in material? Because it's common material. Let's just place ourselves an anvil. And let's rename this to. I know. Let's do it! Let's do this. Sure. Jeff. Jeffrey. Jeffrey the bank account. Now, now we actually need four copies of these because of course bank my triplets. So we have Jeffrey the bank account. Of course in capital letters. So now we do exactly the same system. So we press the button. Press the button. Nothing should happen. We press the button again. Oh, also, one last thing we want is we want a button there. We missed the mine guard. So, uh, as you can see, 
Nothing is in there. Let's send that back. And we'll press the button again. But you can do it quite quickly. You have to remember to send the my cart back first, though. Gooey. Oh, I almost did my cart. Yep, and nothing should happen. Just go back. And we'll go back. It, it, you can do it very quickly, as you see. Like, can be a bit tedious making the actual bank account in the first place. Um, but once it's once you made it, it's fine. Now, Jeffrey the bank. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, all I've got time for today, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, if you enjoyed, leave a like and even do all that good fancy stuff. So, um, I think I'll just have to see you in the next video. No. Bye. I'll see you later. Bye. See you all later. Bye.